Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 3. Today is episode number 184. If you want to help support the channel, then leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe, and feel free to check out the other videos in the Forza Mega series. Now let's get into the content. This episode was streamed live on YouTube. If you want to make sure to catch the streams, then be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation or PC, then check out Enaba in the description down below. Alright, what is up everybody? I am here with a brand new capture card. I'm hoping that the quality is going to come through both on the stream and in the videos. Uh, that's a funny story. Basically, long story short, obviously I've told stream this, but I'm going to tell the video this. I had to buy a new motherboard with my capture card, because uh, unfortunately the capture card didn't fit. So, fun! I had to buy a new motherboard, everything, it was a nightmare, but we've got the capture card working. Uh, we're going to move on to the World Championship Class S, and as promised, I'm taking the McLaren F1. We're going to be starting with Sebring, then second to Catalonia, Sedona, Silverstone, Suzuka, New York, Le Mans, and then finishing off with a little bit of Sunset Peninsula. Let's get going. Intro videos are like so 2010 YouTube. You know, you're such a boomer. Alex, you're such a boomer. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is such a nice sounding engine. I don't care if the Bugatti is faster. I'm going to be fighting it because I want to drive this car. So I'm aiming to get this championship, the next one, and potentially a substantial portion of the one after that. Because the final Forza stream is on Friday. After that, I don't really want to be doing more Motorsport 4 or Motorsport 3, sorry. You and me Mecha Zoomers, theoretically. That is even bigger insult. Yeah, that is a huge insult. Why the fuck are you comparing me to them? A Zoomer. What what game are you are you planning, Alex? Where are you fucking deluded? Oh, do you know what? I haven't checked. I'm going to check it after this race just to make sure. See, here's the thing. If you're going to be doing game reviews like that... In the age graph, we fit into zoomers. What's the one after Millennial? Because Millennial is like... I thought that was from like 2003 all the way to like 1997. I thought that was Millennials. I don't understand this generation stuff. It makes no sense. Oh, actually, I want to see the interior. Ah, oh, this is a nice interior. But wouldn't you think the millennial, because it's a new millennia? Oh, fuck, yeah, fuck me. I'm a zoomer. What's the new generation class as? Well, there's so many generations, it's complicated. It's too complicated. Well, one thing I am pretty happy about, um, compared to the old capture card, is a lot of the video stutters that I was having before they seem to be really 
cut down. I think there's still the occasional one or two stutters, but I think that's just OBS. Gen Alpha. Jesus Christ. So Gen Z is like 2005 onwards. <laughs> Essentially Fortnite players. Damn. The fact that Fortnite as a game exists is just disgusting. Ding, ding, ding. Bim, bim, bim. Bim, bim, bim. Boom, boom, boom. By the way, chat, uh, I have access to the crew Motorfest. And, surprisingly, there's no NDA. I have no NDA. There's no NDA to sign to gain access to it. Even the email that's given me the code that has access to the crew 2 says you are allowed to take videos. You are allowed to live stream it. Like, it explicitly says it on the email. And I'm genuinely tempting to move the next Friday's stream. Even if I do a couple hours and I split it into two streams. Where I do... Um... The Crew Motorfest in the morning. Like, I'll wake up at 10 o'clock. Oot shit. What do you mean stream went oof? Because you can't play it. It's closed. Beta. You need an access code to actually play it. So if you haven't been sent one by Ubisoft, you can't play it. Um, Because it's a closed beta rather than an open beta. So I obviously got access to Motorfest Insider. Um, but I've also got an PS5 code um, for the PS5 version of it. So I'm going to install the PS5 version, give it, I, I want to give it a go just because of the fact that if they give you any exclusive stuff for playing it, then I want to get that exclusive stuff. Dim 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 dim. If it wasn't for the fact that the email was sent yesterday, this stream would have been changed. So, but I think I might do an extra stream with sort of a little gap between, maybe like an hour gap or something, just to chill. Your YouTube went oof. Fix it. Fix it, bitch. Sorry, I'm just checking that just in case it's an email from YouTube. But it's how I look now. We'll be on to the mom. You know I know where you live. You don't know where I live now, though. I mean, you do, but you've forgotten. You have forgotten where I live. Speaking of which, when are you coming over? I've told you many times, come over. Join the Bantmobile. And join the Banter House. But no! Oh no, it's too far! Oh no, I've got to get home to my mummy! <laughs> Next month, man has no money. I have no money and I'm still able to get the bus to work. You don't need money to be up. Well, actually, you need money. 
I get less money than you. I've bought a motherboard for my computer, and yet still you're... Mans is so irresponsible with money, it's unreal. Oh my gosh, Heinz! How have you got my IP address? Oh my god! Zero dot zero dot zero dot one? Ah. I'm gonna go and die now. He's stolen my IP. <laughs> I've stolen your intellectual property. Please pay me 50 pounds and do not pass go. <laughs> See, that's funny because I stole intellectual property to make that joke. You know, Monopoly. Intellect. Never mind. Never mind. If you didn't get the joke, it, it, you. No, you've. Ho hopeless. Hopeless! Whoa! That was sick. Oh, unintentional, but sick. I have to have you on man's phone. You broke my internet on my PC. No, your internet on your PC is shit. You have a little antenna that sticks out of the top. Anyways, you should be watching on the phone anyways. <coughs> Pre-order me FMA and I won't share it anywhere else. Sorry, are, are you blackmailing me? Is this... Is this blackmail going on in my own chat? My disappointment is immeasurable and my day has been motherfuckingly ruined. <laughs> and it just goes on. <laughs> joke is joke, right? Joke is joke, but when joke is not joke, joke is not joke. But how do you know when joke is joke if joke is not joke sometimes, but joke is joke sometimes? Joke, not joke. Joke. Ha <laughs> ha, get wrecked. Time to shut the roof down. This is not how I woke up, but it's how I look now. Bam bano, bam bano, bano, bam bano. I'm looking forward though to actually being able to like record 4K footage whilst also streaming in 1080p. Because the whole point of getting this capture card is that when when it comes to Horizon One, which actually does support 4K output, it, it's not real 4K, but it supports 4K output. I'm very tempted. I'll give your stream your address if you don't give me cookies. I've already given you cookies. Every time you watch my stream, I give you cookies in your web browser. See? I'm smart. <laughs> browser cookies. Heinz, <laughs> stop stealing my jokes. <laughs> Great minds think alike. With a pocket full of shells. They rally round the family with a pocket full of shells. They rally round the family. You can tell how innocent my mind was as a kid. Because when I was playing Guitar Hero and this song was on there, I thought it was like pocketfuls of shells from like the beach. I didn't realize it was like a metaphor for like fucking bullets and shit. <laughs> cemetery now. Rally around the family. Pocket full of shells. Rally around the family. Raw <laughs> innocent ones. Dun dun dun. They rally around the family. With a pocket full of shells. They rally around the family. With a pocket full of shells. The only problem is. This McLaren doesn't sound as good as, um. It sounded in other games. It sounded much better in Motorsport 2. 
I'll take that. Thank you very much. Good reward. Banana, banana, banana. He sits and he waits. Feeling broken and hollow. All right. Splay. Screaming. Why do I bother? I fucking love of mice and men. Tear me down, rip me apart, cast aside like a sinner. Will we ever learn? I'm going round the outside. Can you hear them calling? So, uh, my last stream, I'm, I'm kind of keeping the audio level as it is, just to see as like a test. But uh, my last stream got blocked, like completely, um, because there's so much copyrighted audio in it. Which really surprises me, because there was less copyrighted audio than the 12-hour stream. So, I don't know whether it's just like, I've had my warnings of copyright, and now they're just instantly blocking my streams. Could be. Who knows? Um, but, yeah, the last stream got blocked. So, for anyone who is a channel member, who maybe potentially went to try and look for it, it's gone. It doesn't exist. It exists solely for my own use now, because it's blocked everywhere. Um, so I haven't deleted it because of the fact that I need it still for, like, analytics. As soon as I delete it, the analytics assigned to it disappear. The views will disappear on my view count, everything. So I'm trying not to delete it, but obviously you can't see it. It's basically like a permanently private video. Um, yeah, it sucks that that has to happen, but at the same time, I am using copyrighted music in the stream, so if it gets blocked because of that, fair play. But uh, the stream is also too long to actually use YouTube's uh, muting and cutting tools, so I can't actually mute the audio either. I've got the raw footage, yeah. Um, but the obviously what... It, when I'm recording, I record directly to my PC. So right now, I'm recording to my PC the gameplay. So all the stuff in the background, it's all being recorded. No overlays, no nothing. It's just what's coming out of the capture card. It's being recorded. That's why I was saying when I was checking the videos that I need to make sure that it's just the car noise that I can hear. Then I'm also recording my webcam as its own separate thing, and that thing will only have my microphone. So the gameplay has just the game and the game audio. The webcam only has, well, the webcam and my audio, but that gets, in the editing software, gets put behind the actual gameplay, so you never see my face. So, oh shit. Um, basically, I end up with a bare bones recording, just gameplay and mic which is what I want for the YouTube videos but when it comes to the streams I don't care about copyright until I get a point where I'm in big trouble for it but uh, chances are slim and if I do get in big trouble I have monster cat license in I can use monster cat player monster cats music is pretty good which, by the way, chat, I need to show you what I think is going to be Motorsport 4's outro song. Which, by the way, for anyone watching the videos, if you want sneak peeks into, like, future series and whatnot, future content, future ideas, definitely tune into the streams, because the streams have a lot of extra stuff in them. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are enjoying the stream, though. Feel free to drop a like if you want to help support. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
That bitch can eat a heart out. Love bites, but so do I. So do I. I love this song. It's so catchy. You don't know what will show up. I mean, I don't. I don't give a shit, really. If they copyright strike me and give me a community guideline strike and whatnot, oh, sod it. But YouTube's copyright system is very good at the fact that if it detects something, it will give you choices. It will give everybody choices. Um, but it doesn't penalize. Unless it's video copyright, in which case that can penalize a little bit more harshly. But audio copyright, it would just say, right, well, you can either um, take all the revenue or block the video. It's up to you. If they block it, they block it. If they take all the... The one thing that does confuse me is whether when they block it, why would you block audio if you can just take the revenue that comes from it? That makes more sense. Love bites. Love bites. Honestly, it's a million times better than Twitch. This is not right. Oh shit. There we go, that's better. I mean, to be fair, Twitch is... They'll just mute it. But that's a li In my opinion, it's a little bit easier. Um, because of the fact that they just mute it and they don't really care. Whereas YouTube... They'll give people choices. Um, I very much prefer the choices. And having a chance to sort of correct... Oh, what the fuck are you doing? Correct your copyrights? But at the same time, a lot of creators who are, I don't know, afraid maybe of the copyright system. Yeah, but that's more towards video copyright that they do that. For audio copyright, they just mute. That's what all they kept doing with my content. But yeah, a lot of people who are a little bit scared of what copyright is. Um... They'll v quite easily look YouTube the other way. Look away from YouTube and just not bother with it. Because they think it's bad. Oh no, I've got a copyright claim. Oh no. Honestly, it's not that bad. Ooh, uh. I do not bear any monetization from this stuff, so I do whatever I want. Pretty much. Nice corner. By the way, if you guys want to help support the channel, feel free to drop a subscribe. You'll get notified whenever we go live or whenever there's a video published. Don't forget to press that notification bell. And uh, if you are enjoying the stream or the video, feel free to drop a like as well, as it really does help with the YouTube algorithm. 
And if you want to help even more, we have the join button, the super chat, the super stickers, or the super thanks as means of monetary support as well. Appreciate everyone helping out. Honestly, it's been so much fun. Why don't you have any kids yet? And then a bit of song. Because I jerk it off. That'd be good. That'd be a good meme, actually. Bada bada bum 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 bada na bada 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 bum bada bum bada bada bum 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 bada na 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 bum 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 bada talk it away. I don't know what what to say. I'll say it anyway. It's another day to find you. <laughs> Watch you. Take on me. <laughs> Fair enough. I want to set up some different, like, super chat amount. Because you can put custom super chat amounts. So, I, I don't know how I'll do it yet. Because obviously super chats you can actually do in your local currency and when you do it, when you super chat, it will come up in chat in your local currency no matter what. Um, which I like the idea of that because then content creators, when somebody super chats, they might not know what the currency is or what it's worth in their currency. So they'll always be grateful. I, I notice there's a lot more. So when on Twitch, if somebody says donate say I don't know whatever and it says $20 you'll see a lot of creators go ah oh, cheers for the $20 or whatever at least on YouTube no matter what the currency is it's obviously a lot easier to go the, the only one that I know is the US dollar the euro and the pound because they're very similar in price Everything else is completely different, so... The fact that they are different currencies, you can't give one more hype than the other. So whenever you get a donation, it's always an exciting experience. And a lot of creators hype even small donations up because they just don't know what the currencies were. But that's what it should be about. You should be supporting every little bit. Even if it's 50p. Or 79p. Or whatever. You should be supporting it no matter what. Me. Take on me. Take me on. Take on me. I'll be gone. In a But yeah, if you guys do want to have support, there are obviously all those ways that you can support. Oh, sod off. <laughs> I ain't redoing the entire race. Let's go. Woo! Ooh, that was a close one. <laughs> Take first place. Thank you very much. <laughs> that was a cheeky tactical rewind. Don't get me started on Mixer. Do, do you know, I was this close to starting streaming on Mixer and starting the Falls of Mega series, and then Mixer shut down and it blew all my plans out. Because I had no clue what to do then, because obviously Mixer is a heavily Xbox platform, and there was a lot of creators creating Forza content. I was very much tempted to go to Mixer. So I was going to make, like, YouTube videos, like I was doing before, but I was going to play all the Forza content. And stream them on Mixer. 
exactly the same as I was doing it on Twitch, exactly the same as I'm doing it now, just it would have been on Mixer. I would have had all the Mixer stuff. Mixer was such a cool platform. The one cool thing about Mixer that I enjoyed, if you were, say, a partnered streamer, right, you could use your Mixer currency. Because as you watch streamers, you got a currency on Mixer that was, like, cross-platform. It wasn't just for one streamer, like Twitch's channel points things. Like, it was, you would get it for the whole platform. And you could spend these on perks or stuff like that. Um, but you could also spend it on... So you could spend it on badges, like little emotes that you could put in chat. They were free and whatnot. But you could also spend them on building up a charity pot. Not a charity pot, because it wasn't for charity, but, like, you could build up this pot. If you started on Mixer, I wouldn't met you, and that would be sad, honestly. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of glad it didn't happen, but at the same time, I feel like I would have had more of a following, in a way. Because a lot of the people that went on Mixer went on Mixer because of Horizon 4. And now if they went on, searched up Forza and my stream popped up at any point. Who knows, we'd have Horizon 4 and Horizon 5 people interested in the older Forzas, maybe stuff like that. I feel like it would have been better off if I did start on Mixer. Because the majority of people just went on Mixer to watch fucking Horizon 4 gameplay. It was a very common thing to watch Horizon 4 on there. But obviously it doesn't exist anymore, so there's no point. But they they would have like this pot. And say for example, if you got 50,000 sparks or whatever it was, you could buy sparks, right, for actual money. But you also got them for watching streams. And you could put these in this pot. And if a creator got to their first goal, they get say 25 pounds. If they got to their second goal, they got 50. And if they got to their third, they got like a hundred or something like that. A hundred pat, just straight up reward for people just watching your stream. Like, it meant people that didn't, yeah, sure, it would take a lot of effort to get that first goal. But there was a way that people could support without paying a single penny, and it would be financial support as well. Which... Fina Every bit of support here is appreciated, but it all roots down to financial support, no matter what it is. If you like the videos, it means that more people will see the videos because YouTube's algorithm favours it. And because of that, I get more views then more ad revenue and it helps me financially so even liking helps financially with the YouTube channel say for example um, a subscription okay I think that's the one that does the least financial support but the thing is subscribing means that you are notified of all my content so once you're subscribed you can support by watching the content as soon as it comes out. And again, that is a great way of supporting a creator. And on top of that, if you share the stream out with other people, even better. Because it gets shared out between more people who can then watch it. And again, YouTube will keep recommending it. It's very much... a a never-ending cycle and it doesn't cost you a penny but it helps me a huge amount and it all does add up eventually it might take six months it might take a year before we start seeing super high numbers but I'm hoping somewhere down the line the Forza series will become pretty popular especially when we get into the newer Forzas as well I think by the time I get to the end of this series, though, I think... 
um, what's it called? Um, I forgot what I was going to say. Fuck's sake. I saw the Family Guy thing. <laughs> what could help you with views? Make awfully cropped bits of gameplay. Then under it, shove a Family Guy scene and after Family Guy inserts Subway Surfer gameplay. Exactly. That could make it go viral. But yeah, I'm, I hope so. I hope we can get off the ground a bit. Because I... I can say this 100%, I work very hard to do what I do. If I can make it a full-time thing, I'd love to make it a full-time thing. Like, obviously, it's my dream job. Content creator, to be able to just be my own boss, to chill, to have fun. That is the dream life. Maybe in five years' time. Who knows? We might start getting towards that. I hope so. Bow, bow. Wow. more of a manual labor man that's fair enough some people are more into doing like physical what I'm, I'm all for like getting up and about and doing stuff but what I love doing is just chatting to people I, it, it seems really weird the autistic kid loves chatting to people seems like a very strange thing but when I can just sit here I don't like confrontation obviously so if shit hits the fan, I try and avoid it at any cost. But I love just talking, chatting to people, having fun, you know. And streaming is the perfect way to do that. I literally just press that big red button down there and I start chatting. That was fucking dreadful. That section of circuit. Oh my gosh, the McLaren is fucking... Flying through there. The Bugatti's on my ass as well. Get out the way, you fuckhead! Move! Bum 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 bum. Do 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 do. Yeah, I mean, that's fair enough. I understand that. I can remember when I had, like, Call of Duty Cold War streams and Modern Warfare streams, and I would get, like, 20... almost 20 people as, like, a peak viewership. I'd love for that to make a return. Obviously, raiding doesn't exist on YouTube, so a lot of the viewers that I get, they are through my own me and my community that's the only realistic way of getting viewers on youtube it can't be through someone else just going hey here's my audience see if you like this guy's content etc etc like it, it doesn't work like that on here sometimes i wish you could redirect at the end of a stream to someone else's stream quite easily but again it doesn't it doesn't quite work that way I think the only way you can do that is if you go into the dashboard and then change the redirect settings but people don't realize that exists and there's no easy way to just do that and then end your stream and everyone goes over and across and whatnot there's no simple way of doing it basically 
<laughs> yeah, I, th I think YouTube's better than Kick. I think Kick's better than Twitch, though. But there are people that are religiously hating on Kick. And I mean, that's fair enough. They're based on a gambling company, and a lot of people don't enjoy that. But then again, Kick is listening more to their audience. To the people that go on to Kick and watch Kick streams, Kick are listening to those people a lot more than, say, Twitch are. Twitch don't listen to their viewers very well, but when it comes to listening to creators, I requested a feature that a lot of other people have requested, channel point folders. So you could sort everything, and it's more a viewer thing than a creator thing. It makes it easier for creators, but viewers as well. It makes it a million times less complicated when a creator then sets up channel point folders. Yeah, I mean, some people heard the bad stuff first. But yeah, I'd recommend it to Twitch. Look, make channel point folders. This, a lot of people think is a good idea. I get an email every couple of days from a user voice, which is like Twitch's fucking platform, FAQs for uh, changes and everything. And I keep getting it for this one thread where people are like, yeah, this is a good idea. Oh, why won't Twitch do this? Or, oh, this is a great idea. And they don't do anything about it. That's an easy one to implement as well. That's a short, basic one. Bobbishman. Hey, so it was Rico. Bitch. All right, we're coming to the end of this race. Let's do it. It stutters like a bitch. That was actually pretty sick. That was pretty sick. I'll take that. All right, here we go. Recording, drinking and driving. Don't recommend to do it in real life, but drinking and driving is a great idea on video games. Is that a good idea to have all that energy drink and then on top of that drink alcohol? I feel like my brain's gonna have an aneurysm. Well, I'm staying up till one in the morning, so. Staying up till one in the morning and then I'm eating food and then going to sleep. And then when I wake up, I'm editing for two hours and then going to work. Come on, Bugatti, get out of the way. 
I woke up in a new Bugatti. Come on, get out of the way. Soon going off, I'm waking in the new Bugatti. <laughs> 4 5 a.m. Jesus Christ. Why are you waking up so early? Damn. Oh, come on. Oh, now I've got to catch up again. Ah, oh, fair enough. Yeah, that's fair enough. Don't be shy, go, go, bonanza. Shake your body like a belly dancer. Hey, ladies, drop it down. Touch the ground. Don't be shy, go, go, bonanza. Shake your body like a belly dancer. Catch up. Ah, I got to catch up. Uh. Uh, so funny. <laughs> Come on. Hey, ladies, drop it down. Touch the ground. Go, go, go! Come on! Bump a dum, bum, bum, a dum, bum. Body like a melody dancer. Goodbye, Mr. Red. Uh, uh oh. Oh, shit. That's not ideal. There's a hole in your logic. Know all the answers. I'm literally drink driving. I got alcohol in my veins. <coughs> Bye. Goodbye, Mr. Ray. But you knew too much. Goodbye, Mr. Ray. What a you? Anyways, how are you today, Nothing Work Cars? Hopefully, you're having a good day. Welcome to the stream. Um, 
number is up Your love is a function Whoa, oh, oh, oh This is one of the best sounding engines in this game What? Uh, uh oh. Just joined and looks like you're already drunk. I'm barely drunk. I've had half a pint, not even. So. To be fair, I am a lightweight, but normally it takes me about two to three pints to start feeling tipsy. And I need about five, maybe six, to be drunk. So yeah, we're going to be going till about 1 in the morning tonight. We'll be going pretty late. So I can get as much footage as possible. Goodbye, Mr. Ed. That call is very bad. I know. <laughs> But at the same time, so is pretty much 90% of what we do with our bodies anyways. Eating too much food is bad for you. Having a lot of sugar is bad for you. Getting too much exercise can be bad for you. Can be. Drinking alcohol is bad for you. Smoking is bad for you. Drugs are bad for you. Pretty much everything that makes us happy is bad for us. Even video games are bad for you. By technicality. Video games are the reason I got to wear glasses. Because my eyes are fucked. Uh, whoa, uh, oh. How do you feel about the new Gran Turismo movie? You asked me this last time, didn't you? I can't remember. Yeah, I'm, I'm not too fussed about the Grand Turismo movie. I think it's all right. Um, I think it's quite a cool concept, to be fair. Especially with the fact that Fast and Furious. Yeah, there's a Grand Turismo. Did you not know this? One hell of an opener to walk into. Ah, uh, realistically, yeah. <laughs> How are you today, Lucas? Hopefully you're having a good day. I'm not that drunk. I've drunk half a pint. Not even. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not that drunk, chat. I'm just very chatty. What do you mean? <laughs> this is funny. Um, it's quite a good song, actually. I quite like this. Um, but yeah, I think it's good because when you look at it, the only racing game franchise, not even racing game franchise, the only car franchise out there in terms of movies, Fast and Furious. Let's be real. Do you know of any other f car movies? I'm trying to think of one. There was one I watched a while ago. Um, I can't remember what it was, and I feel like it sort of might have the same vibe as Gran Turismo. Sonic and Mario have movies. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Cars is an animated movie. So, it's not like an actual car franchise. It's just an animated with fake cars and whatnot. So, in my eyes, car Cars doesn't count for that kind of franchise. But, I mean, when you think about it, there isn't any. The, there was a film, though. I believe it was... It's not Speed, but it was something else. Um, and it was about this guy trying to learn how to drive around. I believe it was Watkins Glen. No. What 
Which one's the one in uh, America in the middle of the desert? Willow Springs. That's it. I think it's Willow Springs. Um, and it was basically just... Yeah, it, w it wasn't... Um... Ah, shit. It wasn't Need for Speed. It, though Need for Speed was actually quite an enjoyable film. I quite like that. Um, that was a pretty good film. I'm trying to think what it was. It was a racing... It was about a guy learning how to become a racing driver. <laughs> Rip Pete. Overdrive rings a bell. It might be Overdrive. It's definitely not Ford versus Ferrari. Because it was about them learning how to drive around Willow Springs, not Le Mans. Overdrive rings a bell, though. I don't know why. For fuck's sake, can I get a corner correct around here today, please? Yeah, I don't remember the name of it, but I've watched it about three or four times. I really enjoyed it. But it has a very similar vibe to what I expect Gran Turismo movie will have, which is why I think it will be a good film. Because... If they can make it a little bit like that, which by the looks of it, it looks like that, that film that I'm on about. No, it's not the 24 hour one. I'd love a PC. Oh, I need to rewind this one. Car heist movie. Oh, then it's not Overdrive then. It's I don't know what the the movie is. It's around Willow Springs. They're learning how to drive around Willow Springs. The thing is, I've got something Speed stuck in my head, but Speed is that one movie that's. So the thing is driven. I will search it up, and I'll figure out what it is. Because it's going to piss me off if I can't work it out. I'll finish this lap, and then I'll... Google it. Whoa! That was one hell of a curb there. Fuck me, this capture card looks so much better. Probably is a million times better. Do, 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 do. Right, I'll take it. Thank you very much. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.